Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Denisio Torres. This is my second chance with the new vision. If this is your first time on my channel, guys, I hope you like the content. I hope you share and I hope you do anything you want. I am blind. I lost my vision when I was 16 due to a gunshot. If you want to purchase my book, you can buy it on Amazon. The link is going to be in the description box below. Don't forget, as long as you are breathing, you have a second chance to change your life if you don't like where you're at right now at this point. Thank you to all those people that come and watch my videos again and again and all that stuff, man. But like y'all see it in the title, we're back with the same topic. Another mass shooting, this time in Alabama. Four people got killed. 32 was injured um, up to this point um, while I'm recording this video. It happened at a party celebration towards this weekend, a Sweet 16, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, apparently, you know, uh, things haven't came out like that. I don't know if it was outside or inside. I haven't heard um how it happened but it doesn't matter how it happened four people got killed uh three of them were teenagers man rest in peace and it's sad man it's sad because i think they were graduating you know in a couple of months and 32 people were injured and you just think about situations like this every time i do a video like this man you think about situations like this and how it's just getting so close to home. And when I mean like that, man, like it's happening everywhere now, <laughs> everywhere, any place. I know as crazy as it sounds, man, back in the day or a couple of years ago, it was only schools and schools and you just had, okay, hopefully it doesn't happen in this school or in our community. But once it start happening in Walmarts and concerts and parties and Stuff like that, man, it's it's getting out of control. It's been getting out of control. And we always come up with the same situation that, that you know, is not the weapon's fault or it doesn't matter if they change the law. It's not going to happen. But it's just, it's too many weapons out there, man. It's so easy and accessible to get weapons. And like people always say, I can talk about stuff like this, man, because I was... People used to say that I was a victim of gun violence. Probably it is true and it's not. I don't feel like a victim because my situation was real different of this, of what innocent people have to go through, man. It's If you don't put yourself in a situation that, that, that you can't, you're not, you're not supposed to get hurt. It's just wrong, man, for stuff like this to happen to people that are having fun in a party. I'm up to right now. They don't have a, a suspect in custody. And supposedly, man, is no threat because they can't figure out or figure out who it is. But it's a threat. Regardless of what they say, man, it's a threat. The guy is out there. The guy is still out there. If he did it once, he can do it again. We're anywhere in the United States, anywhere in Alabama. He can go into a school. He can go into a Walmart. Like I said, did he have something to do with that because of the party? Was it, he was not invited to a party or he had problems with somebody there? You never know. Did he just see the the opportunity to do it? Like always, opportun what would you call that? The opportunistic people? I don't know, man. And it's crazy, man. It's sad. And I'm pretty sure by the time I record this video and put it up there, there's going to be probably another mass shooting somewhere else. You know what I mean? And it's, it's just so often. Like I said, what's the situation? How can we change it? I'm always going to say, I don't know. But as a community, we need to do something. As a, the government should do something. As people, neighbors, family members of people like this, man, we should do something. Uh, regardless, uh, I know all the times we can't see or the telltale signs of these stuff. But if you know somebody that's going through certain stuff, mental issues, man, and you see or something weird on their social medias, man, I think you should report it. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, man. Don't leave it until hopefully somebody else sees it or somebody else reports it because, you know, it may be too late. 
All the times we find out so late. All the time stuff like this happens. They always say that people posted something before these type of shootings. Before they do stuff like that. And we don't take it serious. I don't know, man. I don't know what I think about this. I don't know if you heard about this, man. But it is sad. It's just all around sad. sad. Like always, man. I'll see you guys on the next one. I am out. Peace.